welcome back guys this is the tectonic bundle pack review is it worth it should you buy it what score do we give it out of 10 and is it a yes or a no it's going to be a straight up review guys smash that like button just down the bottom right if it helps you out if you've got any comments feedback things you disagree with or what you feel should have been said or your feelings on a certain item or an attachment for an item then let me know in the comments just down below and i'll let the team know guys and we'll do the best to ensure that we get the best bundles created for you guys in these reviews so how we're going to do that, that call of duty points here it costs 800 just the left bottom left here you'll see it guys cp points 800 1100 costs you about eight british pounds or about 10 us dollars so that gives you an idea of what you're spending you're just spending here about seven about six seven pounds about eight nine dollars so let's check it out guys move mountains with the tectonic collection again this banner is crazy i'm talking to the team about we need to get these banners in i mean they don't want to do this but i think it's we need to get the banners in as a reward for buying the packs because the banners are always better than most of the pack stuff so i mean sorry guys just saying just saying so fractured assault rifle i mean that looks cute oh again oh don't do it don't do it to me guys don't do it to me oh you know just just one more time one more time oh i mean i'm not even going to review it let, let, let's just Mhm. Mm oh. Okay. <laughs> okay. 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 We'll start the review. Wow. So straight away, guys, that has just slapped me for six. That is an amazing weapon. Looks awesome. Eight hundred points. Is it buy? It's a buy, 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 buy. You don't need to see the rest of the review. It's just buy it. Just buy it. Just buy it. I mean, look. We've got the underbarrel, guys. It's running a twelve gauge deputy that means when your bullets run out there's no longer like i need to switch weapons oh what have i got what else am i going to run with oh it's an rpg in my secondary no there's just 12 gauge barrel in your face son beautiful absolutely beautiful the whole idea of it is beautiful i've always loved my 40 millimeter grenade on the under barrel you know guys you know how we smoke that and this is just it's a work of art it's genius monolithic suppressor guys up on front here on the main gun main part of the gun you know what i think about a monolithic i mean if you have got a gun that's giving you trouble it's rattling it's shaking it's not hitting them targets yet you've got the aim just aimed right down you're looking right down sight and it's still missing oh it's not got it Ooh, that's something but you're aiming right down sight and it's missing targets you need to stick the monolithic suppressor on there barrel running an fr 15.9 so it's a long barrel to be honest it's gone a 16 inches commando barrel and it's a long barrel and it's running just under the suppressor so yeah you're gonna have some steady shots coming off this baby now the problem with this bad boy is this is the delta the rifle delta you know the problem with this fractured rifle guys it's going to be heavy on the shoulder there's going to be little control coming from the back because that back is just disgusting i mean i'm not afraid to say it. the gun looks it's dripping in like awesomeness it's dripping in it but that back is disgusting i mean propping that against your shoulder and shooting some rounds off with that i tell you you're gonna have some bruises afterwards that is a dirty gun completely dirty now the rear grip there granulated will help you because you'll be able to hold it firm and forward off your shoulder but the whole point of that is to lean into your shoulder and into your body and push your weight into it close range close quarters combat you know you're going to really bring it into your shoulder and that's the way you've got to hold these guns so i mean it's awesome but it's going to be rattly it's not going to be so smooth at shooting off even though it's stuck a monolithic on there but absolutely for the skin it's awesome i would have liked to see a sight on it guys but they're doing it for quick acquisition they don't want you taking time to aim down sight they just want quick acquisition so again we'll just have a look here so no sight beautiful suppressor i love the paintwork on it guys 12 gauge underneath for when things get disgustingly close i mean this should have been the do you remember the close quarters combat we done yesterday guys the review that i just was so unhappy with it wasn't built for close quarters combat this is a gun that's built for close quarters combat because you can run at medium to small range with the gun itself and then a the minute things just get too close or too uncomfortable and you're not comfortable with that enemy in your space then all you do is blow off the 12 gauge on them so i mean that is a close quarters combat winner and this should have been in that pack 
but the orange, the grey, it's beautiful. It's just beautiful. It's a work of art. I mean, just buy it, guys. I don't even need to click on the other two. Just buy it. Is it worth 800? Yes. Because you would struggle to start that up yourself. Now you won't, because you've seen it here. But still, it's good. It's a good blueprint. Hammer throw. So we've got an emblem here, guys. Hammer throw. So this is throwing the hammer. Now, I like the way that revolts straight back from here. You see the hammer and tectonic. We've got the hammer throw. Why is the hammer there, though? Gold and heavy and iron and then here it's... Well, it's just not gold, heavy or iron. But yeah, it's okay. No, it's not. I don't like it. Oof. Hello, Dad. Beautiful. Beautiful. Like, come on. Guys, who doesn't like a good pig with horns? That is absolutely amazing. It's one of the best calling cards I've seen in a long while, to be honest. Out of all the packs I've reviewed so far, I think that is, if you go on featured as in a player, that is one of the best calling cards I've seen that actually features a person. And that is a person, guys. I mean, don't be hating. That's a person. Looks awesome. Clap eyes on that and you know you've met someone good. That is awesome. So, good gun. Good calling card. 800 all the way. Yes. I mean, now watch this, guys. This is not the value. Or it is the value. But you're going to question this, and I know you are. It's a 9. Is it a 9? I mean, it's not a huge bundle, but the price is not huge, guys. So, I mean, it's 8 or 9. Personal, what I say to the team, it's a 9 out of 10. Great job. It would have been a 10 out of 10 if that was sold, if that was more like that. You know, if you made the hammer into his greys off his suit and put it on that and proper made it just stand out more, step out a bit more. Give it some of this fire that you see here or here. Then it would have been a 10 out of 10. 9 out of 10, guys. You could go to 8 out of 10, but I say 9 out of 10. Is it a buy? It's a buy. So I hope that helped you out to make the decision. Tectonic is definitely vibrating through my senses, guys, and it's amazing. So it's definitely one for me. With that being said, I'll catch you in the next one, guys.